Red Run's prices have recently skyrocketed and it's all because of me. So some of the reasons why this happened is because I posted a video on my Red Bronze farm a couple weeks ago. So when I released that video around two weeks ago, Red Bronze was selling for around 900k each at the published shops as you can see right here. And then after I released that video it started going up and now you can actually see people selling it at published shops from 1.3 million coins each to 2 million coins, what is insane in my opinion. Now, if I go ahead and do some math with my calculator, because I can't do math, we get around 2,900 every single time I AFK overnight, and if we times that by, let's just say, 1.6 million coins, we can go ahead and get 4.6 billion coins in just 24 hours. What is insane in my opinion, since I know, like, LPC farms, I know some can actually make up to 5 billion, but in my opinion, I don't want to go ahead and actually spend 500 billion billion plus just to build the farm. Okay, so I'm at my alt and I actually want to go over some things what I've actually changed to this island, as you can see right here. So, some of the things I actually went ahead and changed is from all these glass blocks right here, all to the actual solid block since I actually realized that it was lagging my island quite a fair bit and the less lag you have the more you're going to produce since there's going to be no lag for these ingots to get here. And another thing that is important is I made a mi huge mistake of making the tube out of glass. When a ore drops all the way down here it would hit the other wall and fly through it because it was glass so that was a huge problem so if you have already built the farm go ahead and just make sure the tube right here is not glass since things are gonna fly out and you don't want that happening to gold or anything else now, another thing what I've actually done in the smelting section is I'm testing the coal totems right here with a level 10 efficiency, and then we'll go ahead and feed it coal, what seems to actually be working out quite well, since this method over here, you either have a timed input output chest, what actually goes ahead and you can have it on 30 seconds or 35 seconds, and the massive problem with this is if you have it at 35 seconds with no coal for around 3 seconds, and then that is a huge delay when it multiplies over a couple hours and stuff like that or you're gonna have this on 30 seconds and there's going to be a load of coal just sitting there what is going to lag you I might actually change this all to this so if you want to copy it it's pretty much just a conveyor two conveyors and then a randomizer and then it just comes off like that what well, is not hard to do at all and it's a lot cheaper than a timed input output chest but yeah, that's all the changes I made to the farm, and now let's go over how much I've actually gone ahead and made in around 11 days of AFKing this farm non-stop. So I've got my laptop right behind me, you can't see it because I don't have a face cam and you don't know what I look like, but it's sitting there right there just auto-clicking right where the reconnect button is just in case you disconnect, and now how you find that is just wait for it to disconnect or disconnect your internet or something like that, so then you can go ahead and put your auto-clicker right there. So I have it on every 5 seconds it will click. What is really Really good so it will never disconnect it is actually pretty smart in my opinion but yeah that alt has been afking there for around 11 days and I have 33,000 red bronze ingots what is absolutely insane if I go ahead and do the calculations on this that means I would have 52 billion coins worth of red bronze what is insane and I got this in only 11 days Imagine how much I could make in 22 days. A hundred billion. It's insane. So yeah, this farm went from around making 2.6 billion when I released that video to around 4.6 billion coins a day. And it's so good for its price since like this actual farm is so cheap in my opinion. Except the time input output chest is probably one of the most expensive things here. But anything up there is just all pretty much cheap in my opinion. And the thing is you don't even have to use pastel or any other colored fancy blocks. You could use dirt and oak stairs. It is not hard to build. Now, I'm gonna actually go to some random shops and see how much they're actually selling it for. Okay, so now I'm here, I'm just gonna go ahead and find the red bronze. 
So yeah, they're only buying it for 450,000 and you'll only see this at the lowest. How much would I make? I would still make 1.3 billion coins in just a day, but it's still pretty good. Now, I don't recommend you sell it to one of these shops. I recommend you actually go ahead and sell it to a shop what has it for a lot higher since I can actually, I found some shops what are buying it for 700k to around 800k at most, but if I found a shop where we're selling it for 800k, just take a little longer to actually find it, I can make still 2.3 billion coins, so, so it's definitely worth it to go any of these shops right here and try and like just find one what has high price. And there we go, see this shop is selling it for 1.2 million and then they're buying it for 1 million, so yeah, see I just found a shop what's selling it or buying it for 1 million, now this shop is like not really a non-profit shop, so they're like they make a little bit of money, but they're not trying to like take all your money. So if you can find one like this, this is Cool Shop Maeve, I think I said that right. Um, go ahead and join this shop if you want to sell it for a million coins. Okay, so this shop looks like they're selling it for 1.2 million. I've seen that a lot, but you can probably just go ahead and sell it for a lot more, in my opinion. I saw a shop earlier today selling it for 2 million coins each. Now, like, the thing is, if you're just AFKing, you would sell a lot of it. So, yeah. Yeah, and then they're buying it for 650k, what's well, not too bad in my opinion, but definitely try and find a non-profit shop, not these big shops, because these big shops are just trying to make, like, a buck, and they're just trying to get your money. These other, like, shops like Maeve's and that, I think are actually just a non-profit shop, so you're gonna get a lot better deals on, like, a shop like that, so yeah. But yeah, I'm trying to get to 20k subs so that I can get an actual name tag in Ireland since whenever I go in and talk, I do not have a YouTuber tag and I would really appreciate it if I could get one so subscribe to get me to 20k and also if you want to go ahead and watch this video right up here on how to build the red bronze farm, click on it right now.